Listen, y'all, these owls are just, ain't nothing to see up in here. We gonna wrap this up. Keep going. I mean, all right, y'all, we about to head right into um, Dollar Tree. Now, this Dollar Tree is in Newark, New Jersey, going towards like the down, the downtown Newark section. And I see they got some St. Patty stuff out already. Excuse me, how many people actually celebrate St. Patrick's Day, though? I don't know. Zenobia, can you come grab a cart? They got the Valentine's Day stuff out. I, I love when they put these little baskets out. So they did put back out the seeds as well at Dollar Tree, Dollar 25 Tree, but they are four for a dollar. With these seeds, it do say American Seed Flowers, and it says four for a dollar. Um, so if you want to do like some starter plants, can beat the price. Check your local Dollar Tree and see if their seeds are actually out. They have the marigold. They have the plant. The little pots, the plant pots. What else they have over here? <clears throat> so you can start some of these items actually in your home. Can you start it now? The the pots, the plants. Oh. Oh. They don't even have a lot of stuff, and to not have a lot of items and still be a mess, like. I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't even know. I heard you say it's a mess in here. Yeah, it does smell like marijuana in here. It does. Ever since that that um that marijuana law passed, it's been smelling like nothing but marijuana in the air. All up in the air. Even they little toys are low. So there's some major shortages up in here. I actually came here for a screwdriver and don't have it in so I won't be getting no screwdriver today I don't know what box I put all the tools in that's my issue right now so I was coming here to get one but I guess not today but it's really a in here guys we're gonna look down the um the food section Zenobia, get the cart. Zenobia. I'm gonna look down the food section and see what it's looking like. These are some great items to have as well for like the kids and stuff. For $1.25. I don't even know about the full walkthrough with you all because honestly, they don't have nothing. Most of their items are actually on the floor. Seriously, this is about the cleanest aisle that I've seen so far. They have baby wipes. They didn't have them at um Dollar General um when I went. Is these the wipes or the diapers? Oh no, these are the diapers. Yeah, I usually travel further out to go to um to go to Dollar Tree. But I don't feel like it today. Today is just one of them days. I'm in and out of a store. I usually travel. I think the Dollar Tree I go to is about maybe a good 30, 40 minutes away. Maybe 30 if I put my foot to the pedal. <laughs> but yeah, this one looks horrible. I'm not feeling it. I know a lot of you be like, yeah, this is how my store look. This is how my stores look too, y'all. It's just that I actually, I travel. I actually travel to go um, further out to get my items because if I shop in my area this is what what's expected so this is why I actually travel out man this store they actually have vitamins though um then they have some feminine products available I think I went to one dollar tree I don't know if I recorded that one and they didn't have any feminine hygiene products available at all like anything I don't even know what to show you guys because I don't they have bandages available uh, oh they got the Epsom salt those are great to put in the stock pile hmm 
I really just wanted them the screwdriver. I might have to run at Home Depot with my mother. Hopefully you all are doing all okay to have certain medications available. Dollar General, the last time I went, it was very low in their dollar out for their medications. Vitamins should always be in your stockpile. Always. They have the turmeric there. And it says the turmeric. I think that helps fight. That's with inflation. No, inflammation. I said inflation. Oh my God, all I think about is inflation, y'all. A healthy inflammation response and joint health. Listen, y'all, these houses is, ain't nothing to see up in here. We gonna wrap this up. Keep going. I mean, excuse me? That's fine. Yeah, I think we just gonna have to wrap this up. They do have some items in the boxes here. They actually have some items available in their freezer as well. Some. They have some canned goods available as well. 2024 it says on the box at least for the Best Buy. And it's still definitely 2024. I remember these items are now $1.24. And they do have like drinks and waters available. I think these are great. $4.25 though. You get six bottles. They actually have these Canon snap lids. I've never tried them. I'm gonna pick up one. But if you try these from Dollar Tree, let us know how they actually, you know, if they actually work. These jars are another great item to pick up from um, Dollar Tree as well. Um, can openers. You can't be having things put to the sides and a whole bunch of cans. And you can't have a can opener. So these can openers actually are just fine. I buy those all the time. Hey fam, welcome back. Welcome back. I just came from the Dollar Twenty Five Tree. Yes, I did. And guess what? They have out. I think they always have seeds out, but I guess it depends on where you go. Um, the availability as far as with the seeds. So they are still four for one dollar. So I did pick up some seeds just to have in my stockpile because you just never know. So I have two of the sages, two lettuce, and you can do all of these indoors, believe it or not. Um, two kales, two parsley, and then up here, I'm just going I'm it's a small haul, y'all. I didn't get too too much. Um, being that everything's a dollar twenty five now, y'all know that adds so. And then I didn't pay. I, I guess this was behind the oregano because I grabbed two. I didn't know it was a basil. So I have one oregano, one basil, and two times. So all of these seeds are just gonna go right into the stockpile. I'm gonna try to keep it in order. Hold on, I have 12 packs there. <laughs> then I picked up some drain stoppers. Can't never go wrong with this. These are $1.24. So two come in this pack. So I picked up this. Because you know what? Once these, like if the kids don't empty their stuff before throwing it in the sink, or if they halfway empty it, the food get caught up in there. Um, And if it keeps sitting... It starts to stink, and I, I toss these things out. I don't even clean them. I just pick up another one, in all honesty, guys. Um, so I have two of these because I have a two drain, so I have to have like two of everything when it comes down to the sink. As far as the stoppers, because I have you know the double sink, so I have a double sink. So I have two of those, and then I have a pack of these paper mate pens. I think paper mate have like the best writing kind of pen smooth writing um <clears throat> and then one thing i found interesting that i never paid attention to they actually have canning lids i've never used these before so if any of you actually use these let us know if they actually stay sealed once sealed also i have a greater here than a pack of kitchen scissors and then I have some stuff here in this box. You know, we don't no longer have bags in New Jersey. We got to bring out our own bags. 
um <clears throat> same thing uh oh it must have just popped off oh, unless it fell i think it fell in my bag so i have another um a mesh strainer but unfortunately it popped off or something like that maybe it fell in the car i don't know so over here in the box i have one of these these are great if you don't have one of these in your kitchen and you be cooking that ground meat you gotta get you one because it chops up the meat very easily and it's only one dollar and 25 cents i miss saying and it's only a dollar but it's not only a dollar anymore um then we have these here glad garbage bags these are for like the bedroom garbage and the um the bathroom garbage so you get 13 and no you don't get 13 you get seven okay so i have two of those and then i have some of the bowl roll double zipper ziploc bags so these are the gallon zipper bags ziploc bags and then they have the hefty um how many are in those you get 12 so i have the hefty with the zipper actual actually um slider so it's five in those gallon bags and then i have these cute little jars i love it i only spent today let me see how much did i spend today It says I spent twenty eight dollars. I'm ashy, y'all. Don't do my mashiness. Sales tax of ninety three cents, y'all. Mm mm mm. Yes. So I have these cute little jars. So I like to put like my coffee creamer. Leave it by the key rule. Coffee creamer, my sugar, whatever. I like to put them inside of these little jars. I just think that they're so cute. So I have this one. Um, when you make like little sauces and stuff. I finally seen these inside of the dollar twenty-five tree with the seal here. So pop that open. You just make sure it get a extra seal, an extra seal, and it stays in there. So if you can find these in your dollar store, definitely go get them. The only thing that I noticed is that the silver on these locks they actually fade ouch but i do have some of those so i have three of those one two hold on y'all three so i have three of those and then i have two of these what i showed you well what i showed y'all and then i love these too because it has like that to make sure it is sealed oh, i'm so ashy it got that rubber piece right there hold on the rubber piece right there to make sure I really get a good lock in so when you push it down you know it's closed and sealed so I have two of those and all together on all of these items I spent $28.93 as you all can see so that's what I have today during this fall I was glad to get some seeds if you see the seeds guys definitely get them Cannot go wrong with them seeds, y'all. I'm just going to put everything in a box until I'm ready to put it up. So, if you stockpile certain things from the Dollar Twenty Five tree, let us know. Let us know your favorite item to have in this Dollar Twenty Five tree. Um, they honestly didn't have much, but I was able to get some items, as you all can see. You finally got your snack. Oh well. That's pretty much it, y'all. Hope you all enjoyed this video. If you're new here and you do like these kind of videos, please go ahead and drop a like on this video. Drop a comment. Let us know if you still shop at the Dollar Twenty Five Tree. Um, and are you are you all still using bags or what? Like, are y'all provided with bags? Because in the state of New Jersey, as of last year, I think it's May last year, May or March. Um. We got the New Jersey bag ban law board where they cannot provide paper or plastic bags. We have to bring our own reusable bags or purchase a reusable bag at the store. So that's fun. It took some getting used to, but, you know, they get used to it. 
Um, so drop us a like, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. Thank you all for tuning in to Shauna's mother loving family and peace, love, and blessings. Until next video, I'm officially out of here. Peace. Keep stacking.